the heart. The Heart and Soul Community Cafe goes around the Fargo area to help provide meals to those who may be in need. Valley News Team's Ethan Kramer has the story. Thank you, we appreciate that. Leola Dahl is the founder of Heart and Soul Community Cafe, which she started back in June of 2016 with a few goals in mind. Our mission is to address food insecurity build community and serve delicious food to everybody. Heart and Soul believes in letting people pay for whatever they can or being able to donate what they can or even possibly volunteering when they come and get a meal. We're a pay what you can afford community cafe, so some of our guests will pay what they can, some pay it forward, some volunteer with us. We have tokens, some pay the suggested amount. We just want people to know that they matter and we want them to come and have a meal with us. With inflation skyrocketing over the last couple of years, sometimes being able to put food on the table can be tough. We're, we've been a lot busier this year, um, starting out than last year. And um, just to know a lot of people are working, but it's still um, hard to make ends meet sometime. And so we're glad that we can be out and offer a meal that kind of helps a little bit with some of those expenses. According to the U.S. Bureau of Labor and Statistics, the average American household spends $475 a month on groceries. So with that in mind, Heart and Soul believes that it's important that everyone has a place to come where they feel they matter even when finances can be tough. It's just really important to me that everybody feels that they're important, they can offer something to help in their community, and then um, also that, that they matter and they all have something, everybody has something that they can share. Well, even the smallest acts, even if it just being a meal, can go a long way. Reporting in Fargo, Ethan Kramer, Valley News Live. If you're interested in volunteering or you're just in need of a meal, head to Heart and Soul's Facebook page to find out more. We'll have a link to it from this story on our website, valleynewslive.com. Still ahead, our sports director, Devin Fry, is hitting the link.